Today we'll talk about WordPress. It is installed in my home lab on localhost. I'm using Proxmox virtual machine for home lab and there I installed it inside container system. You can still see here I am inside the WordPress control panel. I installed WordPress a while ago. Now I am trying to install a magazine theme here because I want to publish my YouTube channel videos on the website through a magazine theme. You as you can see I have selected a magazine theme from WordPress free themes and installed it. So let's start the installation procedure. You all know in this case I am using a virtual machine Proxmox. Here you can see the virtual machine I am using and the WordPress installed there the load balance is completely visible from here. I have already downloaded the template. To download the template click on the place I have shown above. Then you will come to the bottom by scrolling. There you will find the WordPress template. Select and click on download and it will be downloaded within few minutes. You need to create a container. Click create ct above to create the container. After that you give your container name here. And select your container password there. Here you need to locate the downloaded image. Here you have to select the amount of space you want to choose for your WordPress. Since I'm creating a container for the tutorial here, I'm just putting what I had here. You can scale it up as you need. WordPress doesn't require a lot of memory so I'm keeping the memory it has here. Here you need to set a static routing IP. In that case you must keep your router in static mode. Here I have given my static IP and left the next options as they are. Here you have to wait some time for the files to be extracted. Now you will come to your containers console and from there you need to log in to your container with your root password. Where to find the root password? If such a question comes to you, when you were creating your container you had to provide a password that password is the root password. Now you need to create a MySQL admin password here, and after giving the password twice you have to confirm. Here you have to create the password of WordPress admin account, and here also you have to confirm by entering admin account password twice. Here you have to provide an email address through which you can log in to your WordPress admin account. Since I don't have any API keys, I'm skipping it from here. Since I have given the email address earlier, I'm enabling that email address there. And finally click on the install button there, and in this case you have to press an enter key from your keyboard. And in this case the main installation process of your WordPress will start, in that case you may need some time, I'm making the video part a quick one so that it takes less time for you to watch the video. After the installation is complete you will see a screen like this, and it will show all your IPs through which you can log in and manage your WordPress. So in this case let's see how to log in.
So far we have seen how we can install WordPress through Proxmox VM on localhost. In next video we will see how we can go online from this WordPress through domain. So stay tuned to our channel and support us to make next video.